The United States of America has seven federal uniformed services that commission officers as defined by Title X and subsequently structured and organized by Title X, Title XIV, Title XXXII and Title XLII of the United States Code. <laughs> uniformed services The seven uniformed services are, in order of precedence, United States Army United States Marine Corps United States Navy United States Air Force United States Coast Guard United States Public Health Service Commission Corps National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration Commissioned Officer Corps Each of the uniformed services is administratively headed by a federal executive department and its corresponding civilian cabinet leader. Federal executive departments Topic. United States Department of Defense DOD. United States Army USA, the 14th of June 1775 United States Marine Corps USMC, the 10th of November 1775 United States Navy USN, the 13th of October 1775 United States Air Force USAF, the 18th of September 1947. The order of precedence within the U.S. Department of Defense is set by DoD Directive 1005.8 and is not dependent on the date of creation by the U.S. Congress. Topic: <laughs> United States Department of Homeland Security DHS. United States Coast Guard USCG, the 4th of August 1790 The U.S. Coast Guard was a part of the U.S. Department of Transportation from 1967 to 2002. Prior to 1967, it was a part of the U.S. Department of the Treasury. During wartime, the USCG can be transferred to the DoD under the Department of the Navy. Topic. United States Department of Health and Human Services HHS. United States Public Health Service Commission Corps PHSCC, the 4th of January 1889 the Corps is headed by the Surgeon General of the United States topic United States Department of Commerce DOC National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration Commissioned Officer Corps NOAA Corps, the 22nd of May 1917, the NOAA Corps was created as the United States Coast and Geodetic Survey Corps, a component of the United States Coast and Geodetic Survey, on the 22nd of May 1917. It was removed from the Coast and Geodetic Survey and became a component of the Environmental Science Services Administration ESA as the United States Environmental Science Services Administration Commission Corps ESA Corps upon the establishment of ESA on the 13th of July 1965. The ESA Corps became the NOAA Corps as a component of NOAA when ESA was abolished and NOAA simultaneously was created on the 3rd of October 1970. Under all three names, the Corps has been an element of the Department of Commerce throughout its existence. Topic. Statutory definition The seven uniformed services are defined by 10 U.S.C. § 101 a 5. The five uniformed services that make up the United States Armed Forces are defined in the previous Clause 10 U.S.C. § 101 a 4. The term, armed forces, means the Army, Navy, Air Force, Marine Corps, and Coast Guard. U.S. <laughs> armed forces Five of the uniformed services make up the U.S. armed forces, four of which are within the U.S. Department of Defense. The Coast Guard is part of the Department of Homeland Security and has both military and law enforcement duties. Title 14 states that the Coast Guard is part of the armed forces at all times, making it the only branch of the military outside the Department of Defense. During a declared state of war, however, the President or Congress may direct that the Coast Guard operate as part of the Department of the Navy. 
The U.S. Public Health Service Commission Corps, along with the NOAA Commission Corps, operate under military rules with the exception of the applicability of the Uniform Code of Military Justice, to which they are subject only when militarized by executive order or while detailed to any component of the armed forces. Reserve components of the United States Armed Forces are all members of the military who serve in a reserve capacity. The National Guard is an additional reserve military component of the Army and Air Force, respectively, and is composed of National Guard units, which operate under Title 32 and under state authority as the Army National Guard and Air National Guard. The militia that later became the National Guard was first formed in the Colony of Virginia in 1607 and is the oldest uniformed military force founded in the New World. The National Guard can also be mobilized by the President to operate under federal authority through Title 10. When acting under federal direction, the National Guard is managed by the National Guard Bureau, which is a joint Army and Air Force activity under the Department of Defense, with a four-star general from the Army or Air Force appointed as its top leader. However, in federal service command and control of National Guard organizations will fall under the designated geographic or functional combatant commander. The National Guard of the United States serves as a reserve component for both the Army and the Air Force and can be called up for federal active duty in times of war or national emergencies. Noncombatant uniformed services The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration Commissioned Officer Corps is a uniformed branch of the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration which is under the Department of Commerce. The United States Public Health Service Commissioned Corps is the uniformed personnel system of the United States Public Health Service, which is under the Department of Health and Human Services. Commissioned officers of NOAA and PHS wear uniforms that are derived from U.S. Navy and Coast Guard uniforms, except that the commissioning devices, buttons, and insignia reflect their specific service. Uniformed officers of NOAA and PHS are paid on the same scale as members of the armed services with respective rank and time in grade. Additionally, PHS officers are covered by the Uniformed Services Employment and Reemployment Act and the Service Members Civil Relief Act, formerly the Soldiers and Sailors Civil Relief Act. Furthermore, all seven uniformed services are subject to the provisions of 10 U.S.C. 1408, the Uniformed Services Former Spouses Protection Act USFSPA. PHS and NOAA consist of commissioned officers only and have no warrant officer ranks or enlisted ranks. Commissioned officers of the PHS and NOAA may be militarized by the President. Because they are commissioned officers, they can be classified as prisoners of war under the Geneva Conventions, if captured by a belligerent entity. The United States Coast and Geodetic Survey USC and GS, a predecessor to NOAA, originally began commissioning its officers so that if captured while engaged in battlefield surveying, they would be protected under the law of armed conflict and could not be tried or executed as spies. The USC and GS Commissioned Officer Corps became the Environmental Science Services Administration Corps ESA Corps, upon the creation of the Environmental Science Services Administration on 13 July 1965, then became the NOAA Corps upon the creation of NOAA on 3 October 1970. The PHS traces its origins to a system of marine hospitals created by an Act for the Relief of Sick and Disabled Seamen, passed by Congress in 1798. It adopted a military model of organization in 1871. See also United States Merchant Marine, Merchant Marine Reserve, United States Maritime Service Civil Air Patrol United States Coast Guard Auxiliary State Defense Forces References, <references>